Okay, here we're going to work this problem that says we're going to convert 16 feet into meters. Now again, you have to be very careful about what you're told to do. Um, if you're working this with a computer program, something like my math lab, um, on this problem they would tell you to use the conversion factor that one foot was approximately 0.3 meters. So let's do this the first, first we'll do it this way. So we're starting out with 16 feet over 1. We do not want feet, so we're going to have to get rid of that. Now we have this conversion factor here that says we can change feet into meters because 1 foot is approximately 0.3 meters. Now our feet will cancel top and bottom, and the only units we have are meters, so we're good to go. When we multiply 16 times 0.3, we get 4.8 meters. Now, you won't always have these uh, more intricate, you know, um, values. That, but you can always use the 1 inch is equivalent to 2.54 centimeters for anything dealing with length or distance. So let's use that and let's show you how to do it. It takes a few more steps, but it'll always work. So if we start off with 16 feet, we always start with what we're given. Our conversion factor deals with inches as far as the U.S. part of it. So we have to get feet into inches first. Now we can do that by canceling out our feet, putting it on bottom, and converting over to inches because there are 12 inches in one foot. Now, those feet will cancel. Now, we do not want inches, so we're going to put inches on the bottom so it will cancel, and we have that conversion between inches and centimeters. That is, one inch is 2.54 centimeters. Now, our inches will cancel. Now, our answer is in centimeters. We want it in meters, but at least it's within the metric system. I can always convert within the metric system later. So let's go ahead and figure out what this is. 16 times 12 times 2.4 would be 487.68 centimeters. Now once we're within the metric system, we can convert over to meters very easily because going from centimeters to meters, we have to move the decimal two places to the left. So that would be the same thing as saying 4.8768 meters, getting virtually the same answer.